it's not just inflation that's on the rise. Data from the Philippine Statistics Authority shows that underemployment also climbed to 17.2% in July from 17% in April. That's almost one percentage point higher compared to July 2017. Underemployment occurs when workers are not employed full-time or when they're overqualified for the jobs they're currently doing. Joblessness rate, on the other hand, slightly eased to 5.4% in July from 5.5% in April. Quoting analysts from Business World Research Head, Leo Oe explains that when, re when prices of commodities and services go up, underemployment likewise follows. Underemployment continues to be um, a sore point for the government uh, for pretty much most of the year, uh, with analysts pointing towards inflation. So when you have higher prices, um, analysts say that this actually erodes the real value of um, the wages of these workers. So in effect, if you have a lower real value of these wages, then you can pretty much say that people would like to um, look for more work in order to augment that lost income.